I'm Sal. I'm a superbug. A superbug is a germ that can survive against medicine used to fight it. Superbugs are also called antibiotic-resistant bacteria. Hey, I'm Molly. I spend all of my time in this crowded pen. Germs are all around in here. There is one kind we call a superbug. Factory farms are crowded and barren. Animals like me are bred for extreme growth. Because of these poor conditions, we bite and fight. Our tails are cut off and our teeth are clipped when we're young. It's easy to see that we're likely to get sick living like this. Companies put antibiotics in our food and water as a way to keep germs from making animals like me sick. Antibiotics are medicines that kill germs. We get them in our food in low doses to prevent disease, regardless of whether there is a known infection or illness. When exposed to drugs in low doses, germs like me have a better chance to fight them off and develop the ability to keep fighting them every time. This is called antibiotic resistance, and it's how I became a superbug. Bacteria reproduce very fast, and when we do, superbugs pass resistant traits on to the next generation. But we can also easily pass on our genes to other bacteria we meet as well, giving new germs that arrive on the farm the traits they need to also resist a drug's attack. The environment is very unhealthy, so new germs are coming in all the time. Soon, there are many superbugs on a single farm. We continue to get regular doses of antibiotics, and each time, even more germs survive and continue to spread. With billions of us in factory farms, and millions of pounds of antibiotics going to animals like me each year, making new superbugs has never been easier. Germs don't just hang around, though. We travel. Superbugs and other bacteria leave the farm stuck to the clothes or skin of workers. On the animals when they're transported to another farm or killed for food, or in the manure that gets removed, stored, and eventually sprayed onto soils growing your fruits, veggies, and grains. Everywhere we go, we reproduce and continue to trade armor with new germs we meet, creating new superbugs at every opportunity. When people exposed to superbugs get sick, their illness is harder to treat. They may be sicker for longer, <coughs> and they could die from something they thought was treatable. But there is a better way. Improving living conditions on farms gives my buddies and me opportunities to behave naturally, like providing us with bedding or edible material like straw for us to nest and root around, building our immune systems to make them stronger, avoiding cages, stress, and the pain of unnecessary procedures like tail docking or surgical castration. Changing the way farmed animals live means we can keep Sal away from me and help keep everyone else safer too. Antibiotics can be reserved just for treating sick animals. Healthier animals mean healthier humans. Doesn't that sound like a better outcome for all?